this time on NTS Adventures. I'm thinking I'm thinking of giving you guys a sandwich if I could touch your fish. Just <laughs> <laughs> deal. <laughs> I tell you, I tell you what, I'll let you reel the next one in. <laughs> yeah, okay, hang on a sec, man. You're going too Go, far. Going too that. far there. Yeah, that's. You too, just want to touch that's, it. That's, okay. that's over the line. All right. right there. <laughs> Yes, sir. Can't stop, convoy. Bruce, with his first. No, that's not a bass. Is that walleye? I don't know what it is. What is oh, he's off. What was it? What was that? I don't know. Life is good. Nice walleye. Oh, oh yeah. Oh yeah, Mark's beauty. Scoop him. Scoop him. Nice, Mark. Yeah, we're into it. that's beauty, Mark. Holy. Take the buck. That's worth a dollar, gentlemen. That's that. Oh, that's your dollar. Yeah, yeah. You're right. Yeah, for sure. Actually, that that'll earn you a buck fifty, man. That's a beauty. That's a beauty fish, don't Mark. Stroke him. Don't do that. Let's take a look at him, man. Let's see, see that. Oh, yeah, that's a nice fish, man. Holy cow! Awesome. Perfect. Did he feel? Did he feel better than he was? Let's see him. Yeah. Okay. He brought me to this lake. I don't know where it was. Uh, what a day, man! Like just incredible. Tiny little guy. Yeah. See if can find her now. There you. Anyways, it was in the spring. And um. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Well, that looks like it would be a keeper. They're down there. Ah. Uh, no. Nothing, nothing. Oh, well, he's not bad. Not bad. Bruce says he's good, he's good. If I put him in, I guess we can always upgrade him. See how it goes. Oh, yeah, you can see him down there, right? 
Yeah, they're just, they're up. just. I'm going to pin us here for a second. What's, yeah, go right ahead, man. They're just on the, just up on, on this side of that fucking buoy marker. That's it. Welcome to the channel, everybody. Today is the 30th of October, 2024. And, uh, Yesterday I was looking at the forecast and it looked like wow, it's gonna be a decent day here about 20 up to 22 degrees Celsius So mid 70s for my American friends So I call up my brothers Mark and Bruce and uh, we decided to go out and give her another try for walleye here We're not gonna be fishing open water much longer quite truthfully probably about uh, three to four more weeks So we decided we're gonna really gonna take advantage of this and uh and uh, get into some uh, more of these walleye. We've gotten a few today, um, so far. He's better. And uh, oh, thanks, Mark. Nice. Mark's got a really nice, nice one there. And uh, we're kind of just starting to get into them now. It's just kind of the start of it. Been out here about three hours. We're gonna see how she goes. hit there too right in this area don't touch that back button seriously stick with us for 20 minutes or half hour it's gonna be a good time there's always a lot of uh, boisterous laughter if you will on the boat and some gonna complaining be and some complaining About hang people. in there it's gonna be fun <laughs> Bruce, this that's first. Not a bass. No, that's not a bass. Is that a walleye? I don't know what it is. What is oh, he's off. What was it? What was that? I don't know. That was a weird looking fish, man. I don't know, that was strange, man. When he surfaced. I know. Huh. Strange. felt bigger than he was, eh? He's a bucketer, though. Yeah, he's for the bucket. Thanks. Man, he felt... Nice. Oof, ding. Oh, there Mark was. There Mark was, once again. Another one for the tub. Probably 14. Solid 14, anyway. Maybe even 15. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Your turn, Bruce. Yeah, I know. It's been my turn for a while, it's just not working out right now. <laughs> I'm thinking I'm thinking of giving you guys a sandwich if I could touch your fish just <laughs> <laughs> Deal! 
I tell you, I tell you what, I'll just reel the next one in. <laughs> yeah. Okay, hang on a sec, man. You're going too go, far. Going too that. far there? Yeah, that's you just too, want to touch that's, it. That's, okay. that's over the line All right, right there. <laughs> You've only been out in this boat twice. <laughs> Yeah. Well, you think I was gonna let you actually touch my triumph anyway? Like, holy <laughs> fuck. Come on, man. Well, this has got to be a small one. Mark is on once again. I think this might be a small mouth. I don't know what we're doing here. We're gonna say wall, Wally or small mouth or a wall mouth. Could be a wall mouth. <laughs> I didn't call it. I didn't call it. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna call it a wall mouth. That way I'm right. That's a nice small mouth, isn't it? Holy frick, that's a nice small mouth, Mark. Seriously, Bruce, help him scoop that man. That's a big fucking fish. Dude, that's a <laughs> that's a big small mouth, man. Mark is on fire today. Big walleye, big small mouth. Check this one out, everybody. That is a <laughs> nice football right there, man. <laughs> Barely in there, too. Nice. That's a beauty. Nice fall smallmouth. Hey, oh, I think I'm on. Oh, just fucking got tapped there. I better start paying attention. Stop producing and start fishing. <laughs> <laughs> They're warriors all doing their thing. Once again. Yes, sir. Can't stop, convoy. Don't look at the paint. Don't, don't, don't look at the paint. <laughs> don't look at the paint. Those guys are killers. Revert your eyes. <laughs> Seriously. Mark is on with his third or maybe even fourth smallmouth. He is, after all, a smallmouth legend, so it doesn't surprise me. Bruce is just talking to all his girlfriends. That's why he hasn't been catching any fish. He's been too busy talking. But another nice, another nice smallmouth by Mark. Yeah. Good opportunity. See Mark's jig here. He's using a is that another uh, VMC Smarty? Yeah, yeah, it's a, a button jig, I think, is what they actually call them. But nice solid hook on it, and he's got kind of a I don't know, what is that pumpkin color? What that something? thing is, yeah. a, is a Allen's bait and tackle bargain bin. Really, a, a, a nothing lure. Huh. Now, and a bunch they, of work. I don't know. If they, I don't know if they think it's a a a, a, a leech. Hmm, maybe. But uh, it kind of could be even resemble a crayfish yeah, down there, maybe. You know what I mean? With the color on it. You never yeah. know. Cool. So you just got into one right here. Yep. That might be an eye. That might be a walleye. I don't know. I haven't seen him yet. He's coming up. Mark's got the net in his hand. I thought we got the walleye. Is it a walleye? Yeah. Oh, yeah. You got a nice one there. Yeah. He's okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's about a 14 inch. 14, 15, anyway. Nice. Yep. Yeah. yeah. Uh, we're actually on the Sorry side. about the no head shot. Anyway, uh, not bad. Call it the triangle. Uh, 14. Nice fish. Coming I at you, Mark. Two, but I in the box. Oh. What are we at? Four or five in there now? Oh, easy five. No. I just find, uh, personally, I just find that it, it works better when we're dragging jigs like this. A little, a little more action, yeah. in my opinion. Absolutely. Not that you can't catch fish with a, a replica bait, but the yeah. tail just kind of really yeah. helps it out, I think. Well, Colin's on fire. No, he's, I don't know, he's small. Huh? 
He's small. Thanks, though. Tiny, 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 tiny. Huh. Thank you, sir. He's gone on his own. Mark, uh, I, don't, big, eh? I don't think he's big enough. Right, look like you're bringing a whale in there. Oh, oh yeah, oh, no, yeah. for he's sure. Right. Mark. Sure. Hey. Okay. Yeah. Well, we'll put him on. He's maybe. 14, I'd say. Sure, then we'll, we'll throw him in jail. Basically what we're up to here uh, this morning or what we've been doing for at least the last uh, 90 minutes, we finally found fish. It did take us a while to find fish, but that's not uncommon. Especially on this body of water with, uh, I've explained to you guys before, the currents and uh, definitely the uh, changing of the water depth, which seems to happen on a weekly basis on this river. But nonetheless, if you look over my right shoulder and over Mark and Bruce's head, you're going to see a, a white marker in the back there. And to the left of that white marker is a big sand flat. And then following that white marker way over to the, this white marker. And these white markers actually are uh, what they refer to as uh, base markers. Here come the, uh, the air warriors are coming back. And essentially what we're doing is we're, uh, we're dragging our jigs. Our jigs We're going about uh, 0 0.4 or 0 0.3 uh, miles an hour, so let's call it a half mile an hour. We're just dragging our jigs along. There's a bit of a transition area here. What I mean by that is a transition in depth. There's the sand flats there that are sitting anywhere between 10 and 15, and then it drops off to the right there into about 22 feet. And that's where we've been catching the most of our fish this morning. And I'm not suggesting we're hammering them because we're not by any means but the fish that we did find on the river so far are right here. I'm gonna bring you guys down to the map here so you can see on the map and maybe it'll be a little bit more clear to you. I'll we'll just switch over to the big guy here right now. So basically you can see uh, right here where I'm marking, uh, you can see right here where we're kind of going back and forth and you can see the depths in here you can see it's quite a bit shallower here, and this is up to a five foot depth here. The blue uh, depicting super shallow water, as my map is set for shallow alarm of five feet or less, uh, in, and the color coding I have set up is baby blue. So that being five feet or less right here, and that being five feet or less up there, and then you can see there's deep water here basically down to the uh, south, uh, I guess that'd be the southeast of us or sorry, the southwest of us. And then up here, you can see where it's a little bit deeper water and this trough we're fishing here. And then on the other side, a little bit of a shallow flat and then more deep water. Very good place for us in the fall. Uh, I don't know what attracts them here. Uh, I know we are marking a lot of bait balls and actually why we first came on this spot. Well, this morning, truthfully, it was uh, because of knowledge of the spot and uh, which knowledge was confirmed by seeing a loon. And a, a, a loon for us usually shows that there's bait fish, and if there's bait fish, there's fish. That's what we're up to, and uh, we've probably caught in about uh, maybe 10 fish between all of us today, a couple in the tub, and we'll keep her going here and see how she goes. Stay tuned. He's moving around like he's a bit more... Uh... No, it all snagged, that's why. Cracked him in the chin. Yeah. Cracked him in the chin bone. Yes, sir. Well, boys, I think we got about an uh, hour and a half, maybe two hours left here before I got to go in. Um, Time yeah, I'm thinking we'll come off the right water at 2, 2.30 at the latest, if that works. Two is good for me, I think. Okay. 2.30 is great for me. Yeah. Well, I'm off two-ish. <laughs> two-ish. <laughs> um, well, let's go in and fucking give her Let's a go walk. in and see if we can uh, get one or two back there before we go back. Yeah. Moving once again. Stay tuned.
push it around. Start fishing. Need uh. scoop? Yeah, probably. Oh, snake. Snake. Snake Shoot. alert. Snake Shoot alert. Shoot the critter. Snake alert. You want the net? No, no way. No, no, it'll make a mess of that. Alpha range, pretty sure it's alpha range. There's an old uh, anti tank range yeah. right there. Oh, oh, it's got another. That's an eye. Nice walleye. Nice walleye. Give me some coverage there. Good. Thank you, sir. Probably a little under the wire, eh? He's a little, yeah. yeah. Oh well, catch next him next year. year. Uh, well, he's going in the well. He's hooked good well. Ah, nice. Nice walleye, man. Beauty. I don't know what's Bruce. going on with Bruce. I Bruce, Bruce is he's right he's there. What do you mean what's going on? There he is, man. He's there. You got it. Just, just that. Whoa, whoa. Too much. You know what? It, it just boils down to just, you just too much, too much of an audience, Bruce. Yeah. Absolutely. Mark's got the nicest walleye in the boat today. I've got a couple in there, but at least I do have a couple in there. <laughs> is, that a, is that a shot over the boost uh, Oh, no, sorry. I, I, that wasn't directed to you, Bruce. Oh, my heart. You, you understand that, right? He didn't even stab you in the back. <laughs> Here, he, was look, he was looking you straight in the face, yeah, man. Yeah, he's stuck that out of there. <laughs> yeah, the one right by my neck. Yeah. Yeah. No, there's nothing back about that, man. <laughs> That's right. pull on. That's pull on straight in the face. Yeah, straight in the face. <laughs> some progress here. We're getting into some, one or two. That's going to be the end of today's show, my friends and family. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Certainly nothing too uh, serious there today at all. Just Mark and Bruce and I out uh, catching a few uh, last walleye uh, before the open water season is over. 
Having said that, the open water season is over for the G3. As a matter of fact, uh, Mark and I are going to go put her away in my garage as soon as we get home. But hey, don't go anywhere. Keep looking at the channel, folks, because we got lots coming. We got some hunting videos coming up, and uh, we're going to try and get into some of the smaller lakes at least once more, maybe twice. And you know what? You just never know. Mark doesn't put his boat, AK the rat, away until sometimes December. So you might see us back out on the Ottawa River for some smallmouth or a few more walleye, you never know. But hey, for now, we got some fish in the tub. We're gonna go clean them up and eat well tonight, my friends. You know what I say, life is hard. Have fun and support your troops. We'll see you next time on NTS Adventures, calling out. Life is good!